When it comes to productivity, do you know what your procrastination style is? Do you find yourself cleaning the tile ground in your bathroom with a toothbrush? Or vacuuming the ceiling? I would put those in a clean procrastination bucket. There's a whole bunch of different ways that you could be procrastinating. And the main thing that I want to talk about here is to increase your self-awareness to when you're procrastinating. So if you find yourself having the urge, I oh, I gotta, I gotta go trim the hedges outside instead of recording a YouTube video. That was a trigger that I saw in myself earlier today. And it was something where I caught myself before I went down that path because I know the hard thing that I need to do and I'm doing it. So this is something where I've started to have the self-awareness to catch myself in real time because procrastination is something that is going to waste your time. So the better you get at seeing the procrastination, the better you can get at regulating it. I have a completely separate video on how to regulate your procrastination up here. So basically we just need to get better at seeing it. So if you start seeing yourself cleaning. So it's like, oh, I don't want to do this work. I know it's going to be hard. So I'll just vacuum for two hours instead. That's a very common way people procrastinate. I used to see that as, oh, well, at least the house is clean, but oh, well, the work isn't done. So trying to see when you're doing these procrastination things will lead you to better regulate and not do those procrastination things. It really comes down to you really at a core deep level, wanting to be more productive with your time than less. So if you're happy wasting your time doing these tasks that don't really move the needle for you, why is that? Do you have any tasks that really could move the needle for you and make your life better? Because if you do, why aren't you leaning into those things and almost letting some of the other things fall off? So what's your procrastination style? You should drop me a comment down below I know mine is frequently clean procrastination. So the house will be super clean and then I won't have any excuses to go work on that hard thing. Except now instead I work on the hard thing and the house gets a bit dirty. But then as a reward, after I've done the hard thing, I get to clean the house. Now see, that's a much better way. And I'll go into that in the self-regulation video for procrastination. So let me know what your procrastination style is in the comments. And you should keep going with this emotional intelligence playlist up here so you can be a lot more well-rounded as a person. When you're ready to crack into social intelligence, I've got a playlist for that as well. Or you can keep doing exactly what you've been doing, but you're probably gonna get exactly the same results you've been getting.